guys, it's Sheet Mask time again. So we're doing another one from that holiday set from the Mask Bar. We're doing the cute little reindeer one. Oh my god, it's Rudolph. Hello, Rudolph. Uh, this is a calming mask sheet, which my skin could definitely use some calming right now. It needs to calm the fuck down. Like between having a breakout over here and peeling over here from using anti-acne stuff on it. And now that's cleared, but now it's too dry. It, it can use some calming, like, for real. So this seems perfect to use. And it's like, it's January, it's still winter, we can still get away with these. So, this one contains propolis extract and lavender extract. So, mm, one of my favorite things in the whole world, lavender. So, this reindeer character print sheet mask is enriched with extracts that provide intensive hydration and soothing to calm the skin. Directions for safe use, thoroughly cleanse face, done that. Apply mask to face, avoiding the eyes and lips. After 10 to 20 minutes, gently remove the mask, lightly massage the skin for external use only. Avoid contact with eyes for adult use only. If skin irritation rash occurs, immediately stop use, only use as directed. So, if you bought this individually, it's two dollars, but buying it in the set, I think I paid about like nine or ten, and there's like six in there, so it saved a little money. So the ingredients are water, glycerin, methyl propanediol, denatured alcohol, panthenol, propolis extract, corn kernel extract, linseed seed extract, lavender flower water, um, camellia japonica flower extract, Pinus sylvestris bud extract, I don't know what that is, ascorbic acid, butylene glycol, propylene glycol, dipotassium glycyl cerazate, hydroxyethyl cellulose, PEG 14M, silica, really, like silica gel? I don't know. Xanthan gum, allantoin, erythritol, sodium citrate, disodium EDTA, PEG-60 hydrogenated castor oil, phenoxyethanol, ethyl hexoglycerin, chlorophenicin, 1,2-hexanediol, propanediol, caprolyl glycol, anise fruit extract, and fragrance. So, I'm really hoping, since there's lavender extract in this one, that it's gonna smell like lavender. Let's find out. Moment of truth. I'm really hopeful, though. Oh, it does! Oh, yay! Okay, okay, ever since I noticed on the package that this has lavender in it, I'm like, oh, please, 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 smell with lavender. Okay. I'm trying to squeeze some of the excess, because with these, there is literally so much serum, I've gotten, like, at least three uses out of each one. Just saying. Oh, that smells so good. Unfortunately, in addition to the, um, the very lavender scent, you do get more alcohol -y scent in this one than I've noticed in the others, so that kind of sucks, but I mean, the lavender part is so good. Oh, look at the little antlers! Oh my god! Oh my god, that's the little antlers stick up. Unfortunately, that means it's gonna, like, go in your hair, but, like, it's still hella cute. Not gonna lie. That is super, super cute. So, I'm gonna just... Where is it? Okay. Okay. <laughs> so, I find it interesting that on the pack it's Rudolph, but the one that goes on your face is literally just like a normal ass reindeer. Okay. Oh, look at the little ears! Oh my goodness! Oh, this is like the cutest one I have ever seen in my whole life. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I love it! Mm, look at it. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, look at that. I'm a little doe. Oh my god, look at it. Look at it. Oh. I am definitely gonna have to tuck him in some, but like, I need the photo prop. I need the photo prop. So I'm gonna hit stop on this and take a thumbnail picture. But like, for real, this is so stinking cute. I can't even. Hold on a sec. Okay, so the idea for getting that for the thumbnail totally did not turn out as cute as I wanted it to, so I'll probably just use the picture I originally took of me holding the packaging. Boring, but it is what it is. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and start the timer on this and let you know my thoughts after. So I once again did that groovy little thing where I totally forgot about coming back to 
filming the wrap up on that video. <laughs> but uh, anyway, so that mask did make my face feel really, really nice. Um, I will preface that by saying that it also did make it feel sticky for a good remainder of the day, which was not as great, but overall my skin feels a lot healthier and just generally nicer, softer, hydrated. It, it feels like it actually did do an actual legit lot for it. Yeah, I still have my breakout here. We're just ignoring that. That has nothing to do with the mask. But, um, but everything else with it feels really, really good. So I'm very pleased with that. I would definitely buy and use this one again in the future. So definitely highly recommend it. So anyway, guys, that's it for this one. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, until next time, see ya.